Welcome, friends. My name is Donald Monroe, and it is my honor and privilege to welcome you to our 52nd Nick with Burns. We have a great event in store for you featuring many of our regular program highlights. Now it's time to don some tartan, grab a pound or two of haggis, your favorite beverage for the toasts, shortbread, and enjoy as we present our virtual Nick with Burns. Color guard, attention. Color guard, prepare to present the colors. Present the colors, for March. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, liberty and justice for all. Color guard, post the colors. Color guard dismissed. Please rise for our national anthem. Say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming? Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight of the ramparts we watch were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in there, gave That our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er oh, the land of the free and the home of the Save our native queen, long live our noble queen, God save the queen, send her victorious, happy and glorious, long to reign over us, God save the Scotland, when will we see you like again that fought and died for your wee bit hill and glen and stood against him? Proud Edward's army and sent him homeward to think again. For your honest sonsy face, great chieftain of the pudding race, aboon them all you take your place, pinch, tripe, or theorem, and we'll are you worthy of a grace as lang as my arm. 
the groaning trencher, there ye fill. Your herdies like a distant hill, and your pin was helped to mend a mill in time o' need, while through your pores the dews distill like amber bead. His knife, see rustic labour dicht, and cut ye up with ready slicht, trenching your gushing entrails bright like ony ditch. And then, oh, what a glorious sight, warm, reeking, and rich. Then horn for horn they stretch and strive, deal tight the hindmost, on they drive till all their wheels swell, kites belive are bent like drums. And then all goodmen maced like to arrive. <laughs> Be thank it, hums. Is there that over his French ragout? Or olio that would store a sow, or fricassee that would make her spew with perfect scunner. Looks down with sneering and scornful view on sick a dinner. Poor devil. See him hour as trash, as feckless as a withered rash, his spindle shank, a good whiplash. His knave in it, through bloody flood or fealty dash, how unfit. But mark yon rustic, haggis fed, the trembling earth resounds his tread, clapping his wally knave a blade and he'll make it whistle. And then legs and arms and heeds will sned like the top of a thistle. Will you powers what make mankind your care and dish them out your bills of fare? Old Scotland wants nay skinking wear that jokes and luggies. But if you wish her grateful prayer, gear a haggis. To the haggis! To the haggis! To the haggis! The piper loud and louder blew, the dancers quick and quicker flew. They reeled, they set, they crossed, they click it, till Ilka, Carline, Swat, and Reel Kit. Just catching up on my burn since I won't be with you this year for our celebration of Burns life. Hi, I'm Matt McKee, Pipe Maze of the Chicago Stockyard Kilty Band. It's a classic Tam O'Shanter there. I'm Dave McKee, Drum Sergeant of the Chicago Stockyard Kilty Band. We want to say hi and wish you a happy Burns night in this virtual setting since we won't be able to be with you this year and something we look forward to every year to playing with Chicago Soccer Kilty Band at the celebration but especially this which would be our 100th anniversary uh, in 2021 so it is something that uh, we miss. Chicago Stock Air Kilty Band has fostered many associations over the hundred years but none mean more to us than the St. Andrew Society and the Bobby Burns Night. We hope you will join us in November for our 100th anniversary. And to all of you out there, we toast Bobby Burns, and we have, hope you have a safe and happy year. Bobby Burns. Bobby Burns.
we were saddened to hear of the passing of Gladys Noble. Gladys served the Nicola Burns Committee as Secretary Treasurer from 1983 to 2001. She was also on the Board of Governors of the Illinois St. Andrews Society and was Clanswoman of the Year in 1991. Born in Fraserborough, Scotland, Gladys was married to Dr. Jack Noble for 59 years and they raised four children in South Holland.
Chicago Curling Club. Curling is a sport as Scottish as Robert Burns. There is a star whose beaming rays is shown on every climb. It shines by night, it shines by day, and there grows dim with time. It rose upon the banks of air. It shone on dawn's clear stream. A hundred years again and there, at brighter grows its beams. Let kings and courtiers rise and fall. This world has money turned, but bright he beams above them all. The star of Rabbi Burns, though he was but a plowman lad and wore the hold in grey. Out Scotland's seat his part was spread beneath the rough stray to sweep the strings of Scotia's lyre it needs the classic lore. It's mither with the native's fire that warms a bosom's core. Let kings and courtiers rise and fall. This world has money touched, but brightly beams above them are the star of Rabbi Burns. On fame's and blaze and page and shrine, his name is foremost now, and many a costly wreaths bent wine to grace his honest brow. And Scotland's heart expands with joy whene'er the daily turns that gave the world its present boy. The immortal Rabbi Burns. Let kings and courtiers rise and fall. This world has money turns. It brightly beams above them all. The star of Rabbi.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Brian Green, and this is my wife, Pam Green. And we are very honored to have been asked to give this year's Toast to the Lassies and Response to the Laddies for the 2021 virtual Nicked with Burns. Here's to our lassies, oh so fair, whether light, dark, or white of hair. Some can dance and some can sing. I've heard that some can do a Highland fling. They've been known as pipers and drummers too, and makers of that wonderful brew. That's tea, of course. What were you thinking? Lift your cup and drain it well, for these are truths that I do tell. No laddie is whole without his bride, without companion by his side. A loving hand, an encouraging smile, someone to stay and bide a while, someone to keep him on the path, someone to curb his rising wrath, a partner loving, true and good, one he could heed as well he could. A laddie needs comfort from all strife. A laddie needs a lassie to be his wife. I give you then, good friends and fair, to the lassies and their constant care. A lass without her laddie is a sorry sight to see, like a haggis without the oatmeal, or a golf ball without a tee, or a kilt without the tartan that doesn't show the knee. Without a laddie for a husband, the nights are long and cold. We know this for a fact because by Burns we have been told. For all that and all that, he says that man's the gold. So if a lassie wants a laddie, she need not search the whole world over, but turn her to fair Scotland to find what she is looking for. For the bonny flower of Scotland is one that never wilts, and it makes a lassie say with pride, down with the trousers, up with the kilts. Lassies, please raise your glasses now and join me in a toast to the laddies. Oh. <laughs>
thank you for watching, and we hope you will be back with us in person on Saturday, January 22nd, 2022.
Slick 